Since the release of the Nintendo Switch, a lot of people have been wondering what the fate of the 3DS is going to be. Some people are saying it's done for, other people are saying it's going to live on, and Nintendo said it's not going to be the end of the 3DS, it's still going to go on, but this stuff hasn't has happened in the past before. Nintendo did say with the Game Boy Advance that it was still going to go on after the the original DS was released, but the DS was just so successful that Nintendo eventually just phased out the Advance all to go all together because it just wasn't selling. And a lot of people are wondering if this is going to be the same that the Switch is just going to do so well that they should just go and end the end the 3DS because in the end the Switch is a handheld and as well as a console. So if it can do both. What's the point of having another handheld? So it is, ha has been getting some, some stories of what's going to happen to it. But today, Nintendo has announced another product. They have announced the new 2DS XL. I... what? I don't even really get it. I mean... I can understand why they're still making the new games, but do they really have to make a brand new handheld? This late until the 3DS's life? I mean, it's what, seven years old now? and Or six? And they're coming out with this stuff? It, it just seems kind of worthless to me because... It seems like it's a last ditch effort to go and have the 3DS last a little longer. The Switch is just, it's doing really well right now. It's its bringing in the money. It's not doing what the Wii U did. It's not being a big flop. The Wii, or the Switch, is bringing in the money. So, what, is there really any reason to go and do this? Because to me, there isn't. This is just another cash-in. It's, it's just another way to go and milk this product. And sadly, Nintendo has always been known for doing these things. They love their milk their products. They did it with the Game Boy. They had the original Game Boy, the Game Boy Light, the Game Boy Pocket, the Game Boy Color. They do this with a lot of their products. They will milk it until it's dry. They don't care just what it takes. They will keep milking it, then they will put that cow aside, and then milk another cow. That's unfortunately the way they have always worked. They will go and milk something and just until just it won't sell anymore, and then they will move on to the next product. The 3DS is just... I mean, I like it. It's a good system, but it's six years old now. And it's getting to that point where they do need to move on. It's not selling as as well as it was back in 2013 or so. And people are starting to move on to the Switch. So what's really the point of doing this? Nintendo is just... I mean, I know they need to go and get in all this money, get in the money that they lost for the Wii U, but... Do they really need to make another version of the 3DS? I mean, yes, I know it's a 2DS, but they're the same thing. And, I will admit, the system looks really nice. It looks sleek. It looks futuristic. I, I love the way it looks. I mean, it does kind of make me want to have it. But, even though I'm making this video, which is kind of hypocritical. But, it's just... And, and it, also, it can also do a few new things. It can have amiibos and things like that. But, at this point, it just kind of makes me wonder if it's really worth it. Are people really going to go up and buy this thing unless it's for a collection or just some 8 year old who doesn't have one for some reason yet? It just seems to me really worthless at this point. I, I just don't get it because in the trailer they showed pretty much just what it can do and it showed all these games that are just recently been released or so. But... <laughs> I just don't think it's really worth it because it's just 
it's the same system pr practically, but with a few very minor updates. And the 3DS at this point is is starting to become outdated. I still like to play it, but at this point, it is starting to become an outdated system. People are starting to switch to the, to the Switch. And rightfully so, because it's the new one that's out there. It's the one that everybody wants. It's the brand new system. And it's going to be around for a few years. The, new, the 3DS is getting close to being a decade old, just a few years away. So... To Nintendo really just go and melt this product this long? The, I mean, the original, the original Game Boy didn't last a long time, so I don't see a reason to, for them to do this. They, they, they also made the, just melt the Wii to its end. They, they just, because of how successful it was, they melt that thing so freaking much. So, I might be wrong. Maybe this will be a really good system that has just... It's completely unique from the original 3DS, but if it isn't, to me, it's completely worthless because the Switch is out, it's the new system that everybody wants, and the 3DS is getting close to the end of its life. From, from what I heard, the, the new Pokemon games, the, the ones that are probably in early development right now, is going to be coming out for the Switch. And if that's true, if, if they're bringing their biggest franchise on the handheld to the the console handheld hybrid then the 3ds is over it just i'm not really sure if the 3ds can survive without pokemon just it it's its biggest one it, it does have a few other games but pokemon is its biggest one and if it's gone it's going to have a much harder time so <sighs> i just think this is kind of worthless and if it if it's just, if it's what they're saying it's going to be, I don't see a reason to buy it, even as, it, as good as it looks.